Hello everybody, this is Lori Anderson, contributor for FreedomOutpost.com and co-host for Resurrect the Republic Radio. I want to bring to your attention this gentleman's face. He is an FBI agent. He has been outed as an FBI agent, but that's not the issue. I want to show you that he has been posing as a protester. He has been busted posing as a protester. And the pictures have been compared to when he was at the FBI compound at the airport. Now, the point that I am trying to make is I am not stating that this man is a bad guy. I think he is doing what he is being ordered to do. However, uh, it's clear that his cover has been blown for days, and you'll see that in video. I also want to make it clear that if the people on the refuge were as militant as everybody is trying to make them out to be, then that would have proved deadly for this gentleman tonight, because this is January 23rd, 2016. This gentleman was busted on the refuge again, posing as a protester, and of course no harm came to him. He was simply handed a pocket constitution and it was let known that he is FBI, but nobody harmed him. And I want to make that point for the simple reason is everybody keeps trying to make these individuals on the refuge as being crazy and lunatics. But let's uh, get honest here. If they were as violent as everybody is trying to say they are, and if they were as wrong as everybody is trying to say they are, this man would not have left that refuge. So I'm going to play for you today, January 23rd, 2016. No, that's not true. No, it's always going to be the public. Guys are whatever is public, right now. whatever is public now, will continue to be public. Plus a whole lot more. I don't think so. I think it's already public. Under, under the. the US and you know as well as I do, ranchers are the best stewards of the land. Are you a hunter? Uh, I've hunted all my I life. Have hunted, yeah. I've hunted all my life. The best places to hunt is always on the ranchers' land, even if it's private. And then it, it spills over into the. Uh, Calburn land, land. No, no. It's education, and you know, it's kind of like if you want to do something charitable, you'll do it out of your heart. But when somebody tells you you've got to do it, that ain't right. You know, you want to do it out of. Your... Smoking, man. Just vape. How do you know my name is Santilli? Where's your glasses? My glasses? Yeah. Which ones? Didn't I see you down at the FBI compound? No, you didn't. You sure? Yeah. You got a twin, dude. Man. You sure about that? You got a twin. Did you, you know that? You got a twin. Oh, yeah. You got a dope hanger. Yeah, I saw you put, down there. Put your glasses on. I saw you down there. In fact, I saw a bunch of YouTube videos of you, you as an FBI outed agent. FBI outed agent? Yeah. Really? Yeah. You think so? Yeah. They, you know what they say about that? I, I, hey, check this out, man. Hey, I, dude, I already saw you at the FBI compound, didn't I? Right? With your glasses on? Right? Wasn't this guy at the FBI compound? Right. You're an FBI agent, isn't that correct? He's there. You're watching too much YouTube. Did you know that uh, actually everybody here, you know what they say? They say that if in fact I'm an FBI agent, I'm the most constitutional one and we would want them all. Ladies and gentlemen, we have an FBI agent here that was out in front of the FBI compound. Hey, I miss Spink. I have the pictures. Yes. You're full of shit, you don't. I have pictures. You want to see them? Yes. Then you have a toy. Hey, bring the pictures here. right. Seriously, I'm not even joking. Hey, sir. Crossing around your pocket. Dude. I, I, I'm, I'm, I'm sure. Whatever I want. Dude, you know me. I'm, I'm not know. messing with you. That was not inside free anything other than him. I saw him. I have the pictures. People sent them to me. The ones you have. Be patient. Be patient. I just, you know, yeah, I'm, um, You're awful you know, nervous. No, he's not. See, this is what I'm going to do. Don't have a picture. Look at the county. Okay, so what you just saw was January 23rd, 2016 of the FBI agent that was on the refuge. As you can see, he got called out for being an FBI agent, but nobody harmed him. And that's the point that I want to make. I'm sick and tired of hearing that the people on the refuge are militant, that they are abusive, um, that they're trying to start a war. No, they're not. If they wanted to do that, that would have happened to that agent who was on the refuge and then amongst all of the militia, the protesters, and individuals who belonged in Harney County. Now, I'm going to show you a different video. And this is posted a couple of days ago, which also shows the same individual 
posing as a protester and of him at the FBI compound by the airport. Understanding what you're trying to do here. I just want you to also understand that the U.S. Constitution, I think if we can agree on it, okay? The U.S. Constitution is non negotiable. We like to say, I respect your position. You say we share something in common. Uh, there's only one thing that I care about is the U.S. Constitution negotiable. Yeah, absolutely. And, you know, we take an oath to defend the Constitution. Yes, sir. By right, taking an oath. I took an oath. I didn't read the Constitution. You know that, right? As, as do most law enforcement people, from cover to cover. I didn't do it until later on in life. And you understand? I swore to it, I didn't fully understand. And so there he goes again at the FBI compound and posing as the public land trespass protester. And he also had that same sign today. January 23rd, 2016. He is indeed an FBI agent, and I don't know if he was there to try to stir up or if he was there just trying to gather intel. But either or, he left safely and nobody attacked him. The worst thing that happened, are you ready for this? He was handed a pocket constitution and asked to abide by it. So, this, uh, FBI agent, uh, I would suggest, uh, in all fairness, send in somebody different if you want some information because everyone already knows who you are as far as your face is concerned. Uh, even if I had your name, I would not give it out. And I would not, for safety purposes, and that is the only reason. 